Hi guys, I'm Captain Ez, and welcome to episode 6 of Surviving with Redstone. Today we're going to be continuing our series on the minecart station, and today we're going to be putting on the arrival system. So, let's get started. So, basically, we're right back where we were before, just it's now daytime. That's basically it. Now, we're not going to do any work on this today, we're just going to be building just the new bit, the, the arrival system. So that's all we need to be looking at. So, first of all, I'm just going to add on another layer, and... We're going to start here. So what we're going to do is we're going to be using pretty much a very basic system to tie it all together. This is uh, not as great as I want it to be, but I couldn't think of any other way of doing it, so this what we'll have to do. Anyway, so what we want to do is we want to have some push plates that people have to walk over once they get out of the minecart, so they activate the grab system. So what we just do is we're just gonna have some redstone like that. Now we're gonna cover up this redstone with some stairs, like so. So I don't ever see any of the redstone. Now we're just gonna put a wall up here. So this is sort of the end of the station, and we're gonna run a wall along here as well. So pretty basic. Now, this bit actually is very simple compared to our last episode, so we might, at the end of the episode, do some tidying up that bit, but we're going to focus on this today. Try to, at least. Anyway, so, what we're going to do is we're going to make a simple dumping system that will use a sticky piston to grab the minecart, and when you leave, it's gone. So what we're going to do is we're going to have two pistons here, Get rid of these two blocks and put them here and run a wall this way. So it's a little bit of a cramped room that you kind of arrive in, but it doesn't need to be too amazing. So there we go. Once we arrive in here, do this little door here. I'm gonna run some track this way. You notice you come in, and when you land, sorry, let me just kind of give a demonstration. When you land here, so the minecart will, will get it out. Uh, don't do that anymore. When you fly along, you land here, jump out. You won't see this hole, um, like that. You won't see this hole, then you walk up, and the minecart will disappear. So. First thing we do, we've got to hook up these pistons. So, pretty simple way of doing it. Two connectors underneath. I oh, just think I just crushed some redstone. Yep. Oh, wait, no, I didn't score. Um, sorry about that one. Okay. Good. So, we're just going to simply add two repeaters here and here. Add some wiring in. Now, you'll notice that. There could be an issue with this um, torch powering this line. Um, I've had some experience, so I just like putting it just in case I start something up when you fill it back in. So if you put like that. Okay, was doing it before. Might have been my accident, but I'm still going to put that there. Anyway. So. Ignore well, everything I'm saying. I'm all out. Actually, I did crush some redstone. There we go. Anyway, so that's pretty much the system. So it just comes in and powers these. So. Okay. We fix this redstone. It's there. And patch it back up. It stands back. So when you walk off, drops. Prism. So what you do is we're gonna get a pretty sharp drop down to here. Not right there. Put in there and there. Get rid of that. So yeah, let's drop. And that falls down and goes straight back up. So, and we'll deal with this bit later. So, we're just going to power it really quickly from there. And so, we'll give it a quick demonstration. Cover it back up as well. Cover as much of the redstone as we want, so 
the people that kind of go looking for the redstone don't find it. Like so. So we'll come in on the minecart. Land. Jump out. Walk up the stairs. Minecart will fall. Come out there. Perfect. So, like I said in the last episode, what we're going to do is we're going to be start dumping all these minecarts that come in on the arrivals into this chamber. So first things first, we have to make sure this can hold all the minecarts we want. Now, we want to hold nine minecarts because it's how much a dispenser can hold. So we're just going to grab some glass and we're going to build a nine high chamber. Now, we can check how many that goes in and just simply one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, all right. And that should fit nine. Perfect. So it's going to go pretty high, but it's going to be pretty easy to do. So we'll just do like that, put in two more, and done. Sort of. There we go. So, pretty simple. They're all stacked there. Now it's going to get up. And that's very simple. We can just simply build it like that. So it just goes. Does that work? It's like that. So we'll just put a powered rail every second block, and alternating between normal rail and powered rail. So it spirals all the way up really quickly. And that's the right level. So I'm just going to swing it across here and connect it up. Now we can't have it straight going in because it will just roll over, so we have to put a bit of wall. Pretty simple though. And then we're just going to run that there. Now, the one disappointing thing about power rails, they don't actually go around corners. So that's why we're using normal rails there. That. And keep them all up. And so the powering them is very simple. We're just going to put it on the underside of the block like that. And we can put one. We just put the block there. There we go. That's power as well. And we just power every single one down the line set. Like. Up there. 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 And one there. And they're all powered. So, pretty simple. And that's pretty much the whole arrival system. It's all linked up, so we'll give it a full test ride. Now, we'll leave the station and come back in. Alrighty. So, is that dispenser empty? Yep. So you can give it a whole test. Press, press the button. Light comes on. Dispenser the minecart comes out, and so you can see that it's one missing. We jump in. Now, if you didn't realize what I'm doing, I'm pressing the W and the S button to move backward and forward on the minecart. You can do that in the new snapshot and 1.3.2, and go forward. So we go forward, come around, come back in, jump out, minecart's already there, we come up the stairs, it drops, and it goes flying up the stairs, and plonks back in. Perfect! So that's the whole system. Pretty basic, a lot more basic than this system, but there we go. So, I think it's time for some housekeeping. Um, one thing we want to change in this wall here is we're going to get rid of that block there and put a door in instead. So basically, the admin or whoever wants to be the owner of the station, if it's a my multiplayer server, you can have an admin or just someone that runs the station, whatever you want, and they come in, break all these one at a time, they come dropping down. Like that, close the door, go into the dispenser, and fill it back up. And then press the button to reset the light. And it's all set up. So if someone else goes on this, like so, it dispenses, the light doesn't come on, and then the person arrives. When they arrive, 
they simply get out, press the button, and the minecart goes back in. Brilliant! Well, I hope you guys enjoyed that one. Uh, pretty basic compared to the last one, but just as helpful. Now, one quick note you need to make sure you do is that you can only face this a certain way. Um, it's to do with the southeast bog. There's a wiki page on that. I will link that in the description because it's really important. But you can't flip this design or turn it. You can only turn it that way so it can go along this way. You cannot have this any other way because it's just the bug. Um, so the way you check that is that the mine cart station has to face, if you see on the F there under, so it's X, Y, Z, then F, the mine cart needs to leave on the F2. You cannot or F1. You cannot face F3 or F0. It has to be 2 or 3. So 2 or 1. Anyway, other than that, hope you guys enjoyed the tutorial, and until next time, have a nice night.